<laughs> he just goes outside and he grabs the lizards and he observes. He has this internal urge to discover what's happening with this lizard. It's great. So he's going to be, you know, there's there's no way we're going to stop him. <laughs> no, no, you can't. No can. All you do is Next encourage him, study bring him the materials. Exactly. Especially in those countries. <laughs> where they're all over the place. Yeah. No, no, no. It's That's the beauty of, of uh, looking at each kid. Of course, they're little worlds. But the doctor does that all the time. He looks at each patient. I hope so, anyway. And they're each different. They each have right. different needs. But he has one at a time. Unfortunately, we got 20. So we have to learn to, to do that. To juggle. To juggle, exactly. That's but, the challenge. But that's where the uh, computer-assisted instruction helps. Oh, that's where technology right. comes into yeah. play. I don't have to be the person who's always teaching. Right. They can do it themselves. All I do is encourage them to continue doing it, pat them on the back, mm -hmm. say, that's great, you're great. So I remember the first time my teacher said to me, hey, you're smarter than you think. <laughs> mm. Yeah. And that... I had a sister that finished all this at 16, and oh. I went to that school. Oh. So compared to my sister, I was dumb. Right. Right. Yeah. But that teacher knew what to say to you, <laughs> to spark yeah. you. Because most of the time they would say, you can't be Shirley Fisher's brother. <laughs> I mean, that's what they said to me. Sure. It, with, yeah. with a negative tenor tone, not a positive tone. <laughs> I was competing with her. Right. She was five years older. I was competing with her, and she wasn't competing with me. No. But they looked at that as the same family. And it's just a natural tendency among teachers to say things like that. We don't realize what we're doing to the kid. What they did to me was not do anything. But the, except for this one kid, uh, one teacher. The that one said, teacher was worse yeah. than all, especially the French teacher. Mm. It's a true story. I entered the. I was in high school, and I took French, and, uh, but. It, some days it interfered with my playing soccer <laughs> because we used to leave by bus and go play someplace. And that, I missed that class. So was, I must have been a junior, I think, at the time. Anyway, what happened was if you didn't get 75 on the Regent, you had, they had to pass you if you got 75 on the Regent. So he said to me, Abe, you are not going to pass this course. I never got an F in my life, so I said to myself, i got to go home and I'm going to work with my mother. So my poor mother <laughs> used to work with me in French, and I didn't go to that class uh, because I was playing soccer, and that was more important than going to that class because <laughs> I didn't have the language ability, but I had to, I had to pass French. So I took the region. I got 77. <laughs> <laughs> My kid brother had the same teacher, and he's five, four years younger. So I went in once. My mother was working, so I went with, for my brother because he wasn't doing well. <laughs> and so I went in place of my mother. But I, I did that kind of, I like that because I was in college at the time. And you helped your brother through. <laughs> <laughs> no, I looked at my doctor, doctor, doctor Tall. I looked at him. Anyway, that's fun. Story. 